I remember my first major production outage. It was about six years ago. I was a mid-level engineer, feeling pretty confident. I deployed a change to our user dashboard, and immediately the monitoring graphs just tanked. Red lines everywhere, 500 errors. My heart was literally pounding in my throat. I pulled up the logs, squinting at the screen, and I saw the error. I knew exactly what happened. I missed a simple null check. It was such a stupid mistake. So naturally, my hands started flying across the keyboard. I opened the IDE. I wanted to roll forward. I wanted to write the patch, push the fix right then and there, and prove that I could clean up my own mess. I wanted to be the hero. That's when my tech lead, Sarah, messaged me. She didn't ask what the bug was. She just said, stop typing, revert the commit now. I argued back. I said, but I know the fix. It will literally take me two minutes to write. And she gave me the best advice of my career. She said, you are guessing. If you deploy a fix now and you make a typo or the build is slow, you are doubling the downtime. If you roll back, the site is up in 30 seconds. Never debug with a gun to your head. That is the fundamental difference between a junior and a senior mindset. Juniors optimize for their ego. They want to fix the bug live. Seniors optimize for the user. The user doesn't care how you fix it. They just want the site back up. So, unless you have done a destructive database migration where the old code simply won't work anymore, which, by the way, is exactly why we always decouple database changes from code deploys, you always, always roll back. It's not about admitting defeat. It's about buying yourself the peace of mind to fix the problem correctly with a coffee in your hand instead of a heart attack in your chest. So tell me, have you ever tried to be the hero and accidentally made the outage worse? <laughs>